is up? What is up? What is up, everyone? And it's your girl and your favorite cup of tea, T. Shay May. Back at it again with another episode of Tea Time with T. Shay May, everybody, okay? All right, our reading is going to be the full moon in September, also known as the harvest moon, everybody. So excited. Disclosure and disclaimer, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. If the reading does hit you in a certain way, whether it was with love, or will heal if you feel hurt about it it's totally fine because i mean it resonated otherwise nah dude uh alrighty guys let's go ahead and get started so our cards are going to be ace of wands in reverse spirit matches says trust moonology says a time for healing balsamic moon and romance angel says make the effort all right guys i'm feeling more so this is of a career reading i feel like for some of you guys some of you guys are kind of in a place in your career where you may not be fucking with it and that's totally fine that's totally understandable and some of you guys because we're in such an uncertain time even still with the pandemic and so many things going on some of you guys may be feeling as though that where i'm at right now is not where i want to be and there's so many other things that I want to do that I want to pursue, but I don't know if I can pursue them. I don't know if I can do them. I don't know if, if I'm capable of doing them. I don't even know if it's the right time and place to do them. And Spirit basically just said, like, trust. Trust within yourself. Trust within your gut. Trust within your spirit, your passion. Trust within spirit itself to know that, hey, if this is what you really want to do, despite the fact that this is such a time of uncertainty this is such a time of like we don't know what's really going on we don't know what's going to happen tomorrow so many things are kind of erupting all at once spirit is saying hey if there's something that you really want to do during this pandemic why not go ahead and do it why not spirit is saying like don't be afraid of doing what it is that you want to do and what your spirit needs you to do spirit is really saying and affirming that be not afraid of doing the thing that you love and doing the thing that is going to fulfill your soul and in a way doing the thing that is going to even heal your soul okay because with a time for healing although this is still uncertain times we are still kind of like in the infinity war of things <laughs> i'm going to use marvel Avengers as a reference because i think that's kind of where we are we don't even know when the end game is spirit is saying literally if you take this opportunity, that opportunity it, itself, that thing that you're most passionate about, that thing that you want to do, that you seek to do, that your spirit, your mind, body, and soul need you to do, that right there is going to literally fulfill you and heal you in a way to where of all the shit that you did that was not satisfactory to any of those things, that right there doing what you love doing what your passion is is going to be what's going to heal your mind body and soul and your spirit so i definitely say spirit said do it bitch <laughs> and spirit is even saying that with going forth and doing it if it's something that you are truly realizing that you truly desire that you truly want make that effort do it make the strides do the work do what you need to to get to the place that is closer to your desires to your dreams to make them into a reality and then therefore everything will fall into place that is your message for today guys thank you guys again so much for joining me if it did resonate leave a comment down below thank you guys again so much for joining me on this episode of t-road time and i'll see you guys next time bye